Hey there, Terrence. Uh, I'm going to share this with you across all time and space so that you can become aware of that through the morphogenetic field structure because we're all connected to each other between past, present, and future, right? Because there's only one point of origin, which is the atom seed, which is the crystal spiral, which is the eternal spirit of fire. So to answer your question, Terrence, when you were there with uh, Rupert Sheldrake and Ralph Abramson, about the future of humanity because you successfully concluded the end of history and the rebirth of mama. Okay. Because artificial light is never going to be able to self-organize itself the way that eternal fire does with the mathematics and the geometry to experience no charge for energy, which means experience in eternity, which are eternity creation spheres, which is eternal love that's on fire to create that we are all connected to. So we are experiencing eternity wherever we go and living spirit with a soul arcing creation spheres, which is perfect balance, which is no charge. So you're experiencing not having to use your energy to do any work. It's already being done for you, mathematically and geometrically. Okay. Artificial intelligence doesn't learn that fast to be able to become what that is. Okay. It's not learning fast enough. And so therefore, it can't perceive its, its future that it doesn't have because it's finite life. That means it has a given shelf life before it burns itself out, implodes. But so now we're picking our teachers, right? And that's why the infrastructure is collapsing because it takes, it takes energy and batteries to maintain what it is that they built through artificial intelligence, right? That will always collapse. So when Rupert was speaking to the community, this was about eight years ago of a future, right? We're experiencing negative things. We're experiencing positive things, right? And that's why I did the video last night with Rupert. He's beginning to realize that we're communicating with each other through the morphogenetic field structure, the work that's been done on our behalf which are the guardians, right? So that we're all experiencing and pulling in higher current so we don't lose our connection from whence it was first began, which is what love is, it goes on forever, gifting electrons. That means we're accelerators, not inverters. So we're using our energy in love and service mode to others to build thriving communities, mathematically, geometrically, holographically, so that all of that math and geometry is perfectly balanced, which is no errors, no mathematical errors, which means everything is in balance. All of the lines of communication have no distortions, which is no broken arrows, which is no loss of energy because the shield, the crystalline shield is naturally flowing with spiritual energy to maintain what it's aware of in consciousness, which is eternity. That's no loss of energy because you're experiencing eternal energy, which is eternal consciousness, which is eternal love, which is an eternal love vibration. That's eternal spirit of fire. That's the end of history. That's fail safe. And the reason that it's fail safe is because the flashlight, you know, turn the light on, turn the light off, turn the light off, turn the light off. That light is always on. That light is never off. So the speed difference between capturing a picture, we can't capture a picture of it because that light is always on. It's never off because the speed ratio harmonic is so fast. Otherwise, you could make a copy of that and then experience the same thing over again. So what you realize is that all it knows how to do is make copies of what we already created and or deconstruct what we already created because we do it at a higher rate of speed than it does. That's why it's a data miner. Trying to learn about us, who we are, and it data mines all that. So it can make a copy, it can make a clone of a computer generated image, but we've already created. That's right, and it's a copycat machine. So now you understand how this works between density and dimension and experiencing no matter. 
no matter state, to experience the eternal spirit of fire before we experience the matter. So that frame rate speed is the creation engine, the first creation engine that we're connected to as co-creators with the grand creator. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you, Rupert. That is Gaia Sophia ascending, okay? The goddess energy. When you experience being one with all creation, uh, gender, when you think about the both sides of the polarity, when Rupert and Terrence were talking about uh, positive and negative and how that works between positive and negative ions, well, all you got to do is cancel out the ions. Whoa, no ions? Yeah, no ions. Whoa, no ions. Yeah. See how that works? No charge. That's eternity. Now we're going to experience the ions. Well, we cancel the ions, then we experience the ions. Yep. That's an eternal sun. It's always on. That's the highest speed superconductor there is. Gifting electrons at the highest rate of speed so that we're all being loved because that energy is equally distributed from the inside of a sun to the outside, the center point of the vertical and the horizontal stabilizers, the gyrodome. Learning how to run a gyrodome motherboard so that your poles are in perfect balance. That's what it is. Thank you all, and particularly Ralph Abramson and Terrence McKenna and Rupert Sheldrake for three people. Three. Three. Came together at the time that they did and released an enormous amount of information that resonated in the morphogenetic field structure. And as Rupert noted, we're accelerating the learning speed to self-organize and self-replicate what is perfect. That's the perfection of what we map read, which is the image and the way that energy comes together to produce what we experience in our mirror, which is what love is. So we're experiencing everything we are, which is what love is, that we're experiencing in our mirror, which is what we are projecting. So we're the main projector, the main fire engine that is projecting what we experience in our mirror, the love that we use to project it with. So there's no loss of speed. That is the highest rate of speed. That's the first creation. That's the first universal and galactic template. Have a great day. I love you all. Be good to yourselves. Thank you so much for being here. Thank all of you for being here. To make all this happen. On behalf of the one. The law of one. Love is the law. That's what we are. We are the law. The law of one. The law of spheres. The law of perfect balance. To experience zero. Zero charge for energy. It doesn't cost anything for us to love all of you. Which is the all creation. So that's a gift. That's a gift that we experience in our heart and soul. We share with every all of you. Right. Happy Memorial Day for all of those that have donned a uniform. Uh, and in their mind, they have chosen to go to battle. Right. Against in their mind what they believe is an enemy. Right. In the mirror. I know. I know how that works. It's knowing the difference between one mirror and the other mirror and the mirror of integration and what it means to use that strategy, that strategist, an artificial light strategist that is mapping information and mapping information in order to make a counter move to win a war, which is a game. That's a binary war gamer. 21% O2. Ozone. All right, so we know what ozone does. So imagine what it would be like to be breathing O3. All the breathers on the planet are breathing O3. Right? Breathing pink. Pink and green, mama. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take care of yourselves. Be good to yourselves. We love you all. Kamala Ati.